Hey guys, how's it going? It's Starkiller 5 right here, and we are back with another reaction to The Clone Wars Season 7. Last time, we managed to rescue Echo from the Techno Union, and uh, from Skako, with the help of the natives, and um, yeah, not much, much else to recap on. It's like the same as the unfinished version, except for that cutscene, and um, yeah, it's still a great episode. But uh, let's get into this next episode and wrap up this story arc. Trust placed in another is trust earned. Well, kind of reunited. <laughs> I think that announcer had a different narration. I don't know, I just remember it being something else. I don't know. Hell yeah. Back in his clone trooper armor. armor. Echo. What's that skull he's got? Sorry. I don't I recognize it. Yep. I thought it was Windu's plan originally to send everything to the assembly complex. Now it's Echo's. Okay. That makes me feel so much <laughs> what do you mean by that? Be blunt. His mind belonged to the separatists until we unplugged Hey, this is new, I think. Echo would never betray. Yeah, Echo will never betray the Republic. Better be some time to Order 66 here. Is this why? Where it's leading? I hope not. No. <sighs> yeah. So do I. Oh, yeah, stocking like we've docked before on separatist ships, just landing on the hull and cutting through. <laughs> Oh, the good old assembly complex. Reminds me of... Is that like the dome thing that, that was in Rebels as well? Like, it's what it was based off. Like the dome city on... Lef the dome bit on Lethal. Good old my wings Gold leader as well. It's a weird voice for a super tactical droid, I don't know why. <laughs> my name is General Mace Windu of the oh, this bit. Uh, <laughs> love this bit. Huh? Yeah, there's some Type 2s and spider droids. <laughs> yeah, Obi-Wan is the negotiator, you fool. <laughs> uh, still love that bit. There we go. No! They have the high ground, though. <laughs> Yeah. Rex is right. I know if Echo will do this. Echo's not one to betray the Republic. I swear this is going to tie into some Order 66 stuff later, and I don't like it. And we haven't seen I haven't seen those rocket droids since season one. I don't think I can't remember where else they're from. <laughs> of course, you had to say that, Obi Wan. God damn it. How did Echo manage to do that, or does it, did they all have to be in the assembly complex for it to work? I was always curious about that last time as well. <laughs> like, did they have to be there in order for it to actually work? I think oh, it sounds like it was planet wide, I guess. It's hard to say, that wasn't explained. Oh well, still good. Yeah. Not for me. Not for me. Oh my gosh. Here's a big bomb. Damn. Ray shields. Of course. Oh, I love that. You can do that as well. How's that a three? But that. It's still a cool. It's still a cool use of the force. Yep. Here we go. Oh, B2s. That was B1s in the previous version. Yeah, so. Those commander droids were kind of rubbish. Oh, short. There we go. Oh, 
So yeah, there was they were kind of rubbish. <laughs> That dark side Anakin. I see now you can see the fear in Trench's eyes. That's awesome. Hope Trench isn't lying though. But of course he wasn't. Yeah. Probably would have killed him though if he was lying, so. Yeah. Oof. Ooh. Still a brutal kill they kept in. <laughs> Is it? Oh yeah, I just realised. Is there no other droids on this bridge? Where they? What did they all die? Well, but that's the end of trench. Yep, off he goes. Wrecker doing what he does best. Uh, what do you mean, my eyes? They're droids. What does that mean? Ah. <laughs> God damn it. Ah. Oh, I love that scene. God damn it. I just love the bad batch. It's just like this whole final sequence was always so awesome and I just <laughs> yep. Oh, for God. This awesomeness. God. <laughs> God, how the Bad Batch is just incredible. I, I, lo I just love seeing that final sequence in its completion. Amazing. <laughs> Ooh. Looks like some Rhydonium explosion there. I think the Rhydonium? The super explosive material? Ah. Taking out Trench, the assembly complex, and that fleet? Good victory. I think this is a new scene, is it? Oh yeah. You and I go way back. If that's where you feel your place is, is Echo leaving? Just like that. I mean, yeah. Echo joins the Bad Batch. Okay. Definitely different to how it ended before. Alright, that is the end of this story arc, I believe. Damn, and that was a different unexpected ending. I kind of came out of nowhere that Echo would just leave, but I mean, I suppose it's not a bad ending. I mean, I like the fact that he's off with the Bad Batch. I wonder if we will see him again, actually, and the Bad Batch. Uh, I hope they do. I hope that ties back into like the ending, so that they can at least wrap up that sort of stuff as well. So you know everything can be wrapped up before the end. So I hope they do. We hope we do see him again. But yeah, I um, believe that is the end of this story arc. And um, yeah, and there was a uh, quite a lot amount of changes that was made during this arc. A lot of them probably for the best. Uh, a couple I'm not too sure about. Though, but uh, yeah, it's still still a great arc, still holds up overall, and um, yeah, and uh, yeah, but uh, definitely it still makes you want to check out the unfinished versions to see everything that's different as well, seeing of all the stuff that's changed. So it's it's the unfinished version still definitely recommend to watch. It seems it's still a little bit different, you know, it goes differently sometimes, but yeah. Um, yeah, so I really do hope that um, Echo does come back before the end. It would be nice to see the Bad Batch again. I, hope, I'm gonna hope, I just hope so. But uh, yeah, that's the end of this story arc and uh, the unfinished bit. So from this point on, I will pretty much be going in like 
blind as everybody else, because uh, the only thing that I know of what will come is like there's an unfinished scene. They they're using one of the unfinished scenes. I think in the Ahsoka arc. I think that's next. I think. I think. Like there was an unfinished scene where Ahsoka is on a bike on Coruscant and she's descending into one of the lower levels of Coruscant. I think you know what scene I'm talking about. I think they've used that. I've seen that one scene, but that's it. So that's literally all I'm going to recognise going forward. So I'm quite excited to go into the unknown now. And uh, I mean, that this whole arc was still kind of different to what I expected as well, which was great. But now I'm going fully into the unknown. I've got no idea what to expect from the next arc. And um, I think it's Ahsoka's journey. I think next. Um, I'll just make sure. But yeah, be nice to see what's going on and. Uh, yeah, going in blind, so, um, yeah, uh, but yeah, I, I haven't got much else to say, but yeah, a lot of neat changes, a lot of stuff was cut, I don't know if it was for the best or not, but, you know, like, the reasonings behind it, damn Disney, but, uh, yeah, um, yeah, I wonder why they all stay, I also remember that they changed the, uh, scene with the Padme tattooed on the Bad Batch, not tattooed, but, uh, like painted onto the uh, Bad Batch's shuttle there, so and that's what they replaced with the whole Rex knowing about Padme scene or like the Outer Rim seizure scene, which uh, caused like a bit of controversy. I've, I've, I've seen as well that uh, Anaxis is now apparently in the Outer Rims or something. That, uh, but I'm, I'm just like you know a life maybe it is now in the new canon, but you know like a lifetime of me playing Empire War among other. Materials from Legends always put an axis in a near the core world, so that's what I'm always gonna believe that an axis in the core world's in my opinion, so that's what I'm always gonna think. But yeah, whatever. But uh, yeah, anyways, but uh, we might as well wrap this thing up here. So uh, yeah, excited to see what happens next week in the new story arc, and uh, I hope the Bad Batch Mecho does return before the end as well. So yeah, anyways, thank you all so much for watching. I'm Psycho Five and Eight. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I shall see you in the next video. May the force be with you. Bye-bye.